Layer 1 Bricks 2.0 is out. It is alpha, but you can already use it. So, by the way, Thomas made a great video about it, and he talked about all the major features coming with this uh, version. So, check that video. I'm not going to mention any of the features. Only I will focus on AI and the selector. Selector, detector, and AI. So you may ask, why? Like... Why? <laughs> so idea is, let me show you. So I added this code ele uh, element here. So we have AI, by the way, if you don't know, this AI is coming from SNM Bricks. It's free, use it, have fun. Let's use that. Let's generate a page, whatever. We can generate anything. Let's select the HTML prompt. Um, Okay, and then let's put uh, me a make make a doctor dentist fact either hero services ETA uh, ETA sections animations e router fully code keep it link native. You can use CSS GDN native only if you want. Yeah, that's it. Let's see what will come up. So it is using the 4.1 mini model. So that model is smart, but not creative. Like if you use cloud, like uh, 3.7 or Gemini 2.5, like something like that, it will be much, much, much creative and create sexier uh, UIs and layouts. I'm just being cheap right now. <laughs> Actually, let's let's generate that once, and after that, I'm gonna change the model. Okay, let's test big model as well. Okay, let's see. It looks fine. Okay, it is importing font, native CSS. I don't see too much HTML, but anyway, let's see. No, not bad, not bad. It's good, it's good, it's good enough, it's good enough. And the idea is, guys, idea is we can use Bricks system UI to design, like after generating, to design, change the old elements. Only thing we need to do is um, teach the Bricks Builder, add those properties like the selector. Okay, see, because right now Bricks has no idea. Like I can use the styles, but it will just style everything, right? It will style that. It will style everything, right? It will style everything. So we don't we, we don't want that. We we want to only design like change this color change the header color how can we do that that's where the selector detector comes like it is crazy powerful like like crazy let's see if if it will it will if it will work like as i imagine first so click the selector detector and after i click i don't know if is yeah it is visible here clearly as you can see there are like bounding boxes like the border is showing i can select it visually so for now i just want to let's select the header click and after you click you can check before creating and header you can give semantic name header okay and after that i can change the css visually <laughs> look at that wow it is it is really working as i imagined i didn't test it before I, I i just wanted to like i just wanted to react it on the video wow this is even bigger than i imagined even bigger than i imagined and when you combine this with ai <laughs> wow of course i can resize it from here but ideally you will want to select the links yeah looks correct 
uh, header a or header link or header nav link make it semantic make the naming semantic so it will be easier okay uh like long time okay <laughs> oh that's so good oh my god it is working so good thomas i am amazed like congratulations like this this release i mean that there are like great other features i know like some of you more excited with the other features but me personally like this this feature with combined with ai what yeah like you guys have no idea i mean now you do now you do <laughs> wow i love it as you guys can see um this gives you guys like amazing possibilities like you guys can do anything select that oops select that no select that that oh it is so weird it didn't made it full 100 percent that is why it, it is not selecting ah okay services i mean if, if i don't give a name I, I think it will just use that yeah it will just use the selector name i mean that's fine too but if it is not a good name definitely change it so what is even that yeah it was weird so i'm gonna change it to transparent so let's select the, this blue let's make it same with the header why not and Oops, sorry. First, find it. CTA. Okay, CTA. Nice, great. Now I selected the CTA. Make it same with the. Hmm, is this a gradient? Let's check. Let's check something. Check something. Oh, it is not overwriting. Okay, okay. We found. We found. I wonder how this should work. Wonder. So our styles loading before the HTML. Okay. So where is this um, orange color color coming? It is just loading order problem. It is not even a bug. It is. It you just need to be aware of it. For example, if I move all oh it is selecting body too like it this is this is not a good thing by the way you don't want that okay let's select the style put it on let's say put it on header okay let's put it yeah why not i wonder if it will overwrite it okay okay now we can improve this it's fine it's okay so it, it i mean this proves like it is working great on the builder we just need to improve this that's it like this is really simple issue really crazy simple issue <laughs> what do you guys think like i mean what do you guys think I mean, the, this this gives you gives you like crazy powerful possibilities, yeah. And it is working exactly as I imagined. <laughs> I didn't even imagine it will work this good. Uh, so nice. I don't think like they like I don't think Thomas or even anyone was thinking about like using this feature, like I just did. <laughs> But now they will have to like uh, improve it a little bit so it will work like as expected. <laughs> okay, I love it. I love this feature. I don't know what you guys think. Um, tell me. By the way, I made lots of tests with the SLM bricks. Mostly it works fine. Sometimes this button switches place like loads on the right side instead of left. Other than that, I didn't see any other issue. And maybe I will improve this as. as the index thing because um when i when we make like full page 
uh, in here code, custom code or CSS. We don't see the overlay, AI overlay. Okay. And other than that, everything else works great, guys. It works fine. So, yeah, the colors are working fine as well. Everything working fine. So we can we can upgrade it easily later on. So good. Okay. What do you guys think? Tell me, tell me what do you guys think. Like, what can be improved? Like, I think I will create a report for this on forum, but not just yet. I will wait. But tell me what you guys think.